Query builder of uh, Procom Block of Jet Engine. I'm going to show you uh, two uh, simple examples, and later on I'm going to give you the full tutorial. But in this case, is for the taxonomies. So we have uh, a page, and uh, you want to show uh, um, the taxonomies. <laughs> look at that! Now look at the mark. I was just uh, playing a little bit, being foolish. But uh, anyway, when you see here. Um, the page and then you see here two pictures which uh, points to the taxonomy of uh, uh, different kind of places in the uh, netherlands so uh, when we are uh, just uh, viewing it then you can see that when you click on it then you see the two taxonomies and this is related to the other taxonomy is this the other one and um, when you're checking the other posts this is the single posts page then you can see that uh, it's only this taxonomy and also on the map it appears only in the taxonomy that we choose now don't look at uh, how it looks because it's not uh, for um, the dressing but it's just to show you how it works so um, you must make an uh, you must give it a name of course and then you must choose for the post query so not for the terms query because when you're using the terms query, then it's going to select the taxonomies and then you can uh, query the whole taxonomies. So that's, uh, it uh, sounds a little bit complicated, uh, but uh, that's just the way it is. So use the post query and you can see here the results when you are adding the values in the fields. <clears throat> so um, let's talk about this off for now. So we have chosen the taxonomy that we have made, and we have made it with a quarker block. We made a taxonomy, and this is the name of the taxonomy. Then uh, the fields, you can leave them empty, and then you have to use for the current terms, and then the taxonomy. So uh, it's a little bit double, but uh, that's uh, because you can use multiple taxonomies. And then you have to apply it, and once you have done that, then you can go to... Uh, the other settings you can uh, use the the post in and the post out so um that is what you can customize but um then you can use the paginations so if you want to appear uh, for example uh, on the single post that we use uh, only the five or maybe ten so it will uh, show only the 10 posts um, as i said it's uh, this time as a uh, simple um, tutorial later on i'm gonna show you the more the details but if you can see here everything else is empty so that's the only thing that you have to do and then you have to go to the single page where you want to have it and you can use a map and then you can uh, use uh, a listing that you have made in the listing grids and then you have to go to the queries custom queries and apply it and then choose the query that we just made and that is this one as you can see here this is the taxonomy um okay so that was it for the taxonomies and let's see if we want to uh, show uh, the posts and then exclude the current post id so the current user and uh, we don't show the post from the cur current user and that's also simple it looks all complicated but it's super simple so um when we go to see how we can fix that then we can use uh, the post query once again you give it a uh, name and then you choose for the post type so it's not the taxonomy but the post type and uh, then you can order it but as i said i want to make it very simple this time the rest of the fields you can leave them empty as you can see and um, the post and patients post not in the current id so the current user uh, post won't be appear on that uh, map when we're using it so when we're going back and then uh, we use this uh, query so a query map query and then we are going to change the
query. Now you can see there are two of those. And when we watch the page, then, then we can see that if we click on uh, a photo. So there are all three of them now. But when I'm going to a particular page, for example, this one, then you can see that there will be a beer. Two of them. So we excluded the current post. So uh, that is the easy way and you can also preview it and you can see that there are three results. So there are three posts on my website <laughs> and it's of course all for um, showing you how it works. Later on I'm going to make a uh, more uh, dedicated video with more explanations how the fields works and how you can um, point to particular posts or IDs or names or whatever.